So, the ponies had Goodwill and Eau Claire today. So they are in brand new condition. I did try them on before I bought them. That's how much they were at Kohl's before Goodwill. So these were not half off, just to let you know. So I got them for that. Yes, they're men's jeans, but I like wearing men's jeans because I like actually putting my phone in my front pants pocket. I know some uh, people will say, well, they got to fit my bag. Well, if I put it, my phone in my bag, I lose a lot of things in my bag, trust me. And that's why I'm like, yeah, I need to shrink down to a medium bag, but that is honestly really tough. <laughs> I don't know. I always keep buying a bigger bag than what I should. Um, uh, so, yeah, I'm like, yeah, these are really good. Oh, my phone cut it out on me. Yeah, my phone cut it out on me. I don't know why it did that. It always does that. Um, and then I have to go through, delete stuff. Ugh. But, um, yeah, I mean, like with Goodwill, they had some Patricia Nash bags there. Um, I mean, they were good looking. I, And the thing is, I... I try to be right now real stingy because, like I said, with all these bag payments, I'm hoping I can sell those three Dooney and Burks, the draft print, the small blue one, and that black one, and then that um, one coach that I have listed on eBay because um, that would all help towards one payment so that way I could gradually get enough to pay it all off right now I'm trying to save some money to finish paying for it basically um the well I I should say I kept a hold of the first payment already for money for that so it's like um yeah it, it's a lot to do when you have to be on a budget, especially if I'm right now thinking about getting the pumpkin bag. If we do get the pumpkin bag, it might not be until uh, maybe Monday or, or so, because as I would say, oh, well, it could be Halloween too, because Monday I'm probably going to have to wake up real early, go out grocery shopping. I also have to keep money off the side in case that one woman gets a hold of me because I got to pay her off. Because, um, yeah, she was trying to sell me two antique dolls where she said the woman paid a lot more than over $500 for them both. And I'm like, well, I can't really do that right now. Um, I really can't. I mean, if she really wants to sell both of them dolls, she drops down to $200 or less. I mean, like $100 for both. So I hate to say it, this is where, like Dr. Lori Verran said, get your stuff appraised. You know... But, yeah. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content. Don't forget to like, comment, and share channel as it would help get my channel to the people I don't know about yet. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.